What ideally happens is if I can pull him in and force this belly up here. If I can force this belly up here, now I can get rotation, not this way, but rotation this way. To finish, we can stay crossed with the feet. And what's very important is that the more this heel is right here on this chest here, now you see how there's no, oh, there's a lot of tension in the leg here. It's hard for his leg to start wiggling once we're square here. Here and here, the more rotation, more like an oblique crunch here for my rotation, rather than bridging or pulling, it's just twisting this foot.